What if? I asked myself a question. What if? The other day I was listening to Justin Rose and how he was going to try to recreate a homestead on 10 acres. And if you haven't seen that, go watch it because it's pretty interesting. So it had me thinking, what if? What if me and the kids got together and decided for 100 days to work on something that we kind of put on the back burner because it just seems so impossible? What if we took a plot of our land that we're working towards making into pasture and instead of thinking about it and dreaming about it, what if we took 100 days and tried to do that? So... This is going to be my first video. I took some footage from out back. I do still have problems with my camera, but I took some footage from out back and I'm going to um, document it and see how it changes and what we do. And we're pretty excited. We're all on board with it and we're hoping that we can get a certain section cleared that we'll have pasture um, next year. And so I ask you guys, what if? is there an area in your life that you could say, what if and change that area of your life? Could you maybe what if 100 days in a certain area of your life to change it for the better? Mommy. Well, talk to you guys later. She needs me. Where are we going? Where are we going? Little miss is not happy. We're going to walk out back. Yeah, we're going to walk out back. She's ready to eat nurse again. Okay, so we're getting ready to walk out back. I have a couple questions. What I want to do is try to... I'll flip around a little bit. Um, right here in our walking path that we're going to go on here. Um, I want to try to figure out how to clear this land that's out back here. That it would have proper drainage and be able to um, be pasture for the animals that we have here on the farm. Um, right now we use it as pasture, but it's mainly like branches and brush. But I would love if we could get it to a point that um, we were able to actually have pasture for the animals that was... Um, that was... Um, that was better maybe that I'd be able to um, do some gardens and stuff back here and right now we have it it gets so wet and so like boggy so I'm gonna show you some pieces of my land I actually was inspired by Justin Rose he's doing a um, hundred day like raw land type challenge for himself and I was like you know I wonder if I took a hundred days what it would look like because we um, when we started here, this was all woods. So I'll show you just kind of like a panoramic of what we started with, where we're at, and then where I'd like to see it. Okay? So when we first came here, our wood line was right here. So from the beginning of the trailer, all the way back here, all the way, way back into there was all deep woods. Um, we cleared a lot of it ourselves and um, then we had a company come out and they cleared some of it for us but I'm trying to figure out the best way see how wet it is here in this road um, I we have this pond here and I'm wondering if we dug out the pond if it would improve our drainage here because it gets awfully wet here and um, it's hard to get back here with a tractor. We pasture our pigs way back there. And so it's nice if we're able to run the tractor on this road, but obviously like right now it's really wet and not really conducive to doing that. So that's one of my questions that I have for anyone who might be able to answer.